Hello everyone, Chronic Clouds here and we're back with more World of Warships Legends content. And in today's video we're going to be kicking off a two part series that I've been working on. In this first episode we're going to give you guys a guide on where and when to shoot high explosive shells aka HE shells at your enemy. To start off we're going to be going over DDs. DDs main shell type is going to be high explosive about 90% of the time. If you look at the screenshot here you can also see the yellow line is where you want to line your shot up and the red circles are the areas that a fire can start. Anytime you're facing a destroyer while you're in a destroyer you want to make sure you use HE shells. Not only do destroyers not have citadels the HE splash damage has a chance to knock out modules including steering, engine, or torpedo launchers. And depending on the caliber of the guns you have, you can even take out turrets also. As for destroyer versus cruiser, you want to have your DD loaded up with HE about 80% of the time. If you look at the image, you can see the same yellow line and red fire circles as last image. You can citadel cruisers with AP in your destroyer but it requires the right timing and positioning so HE is still going to be your main shell type it is the same idea with the HE on a cruiser as you want to try and land on the weak deck armor and cause plunging fire it will be harder to take out the steering and engine modules but the others have about the same chance of breaking due to HE keep in mind most of the time going up against a cruiser in a destroyer you're going to need support as it is a cruiser's main purpose to sink an enemy destroyer and as a cruiser player going up against a destroyer you want to use HE versus a destroyer for the same reasons as destroyer versus destroyer engagements the only difference is that cruisers have way bigger caliber guns and can dispose of enemy destroyers with ease most of the time as for cruiser versus cruiser engagements you're still running HE for about I'd say about 80% of the time to cause fires and module damage and you will need to wait for the right opportunity to use your AP and your cruiser effectively. Now let's go over destroyer versus battleship and cruiser versus battleship. You honestly have no business shooting AP from your destroyer at a battleship period. The shell caliber is far too low to do significant damage so you are using HE 100% of the time versus a battleship in a destroyer that is. If you look at the image we have the same yellow line to where you line your shots up and the same red fire circles where you want your shells to hit on the deck to cause fires and they're in about the same spots. So it's about the same principle through all the classes you want to try and land the HE shells in the red fire circles to start fires and anywhere on the yellow line aka the deck to have a chance to break the anti-aircraft guns, secondary guns, or even take a percentage of the battleship's health by taking the superstructure damage. Keep in mind the superstructure can become oversaturated causing your shells to do little to no damage over time. In a cruiser you want to wait for opportune times to use your AP on a battleship as you can citadel certain ships with the right caliber guns but HE is still going to be your main shell type versus battleships and you're going to be aiming at about the same areas on the deck to start those fires and to do that module damage and as for battleship versus battleship combat you are going to be using AP 90% of the time so when you are in these engagements, the only time that you want to use AG on another battleship is if they're offering you too much of an angle for your AP shells to penetrate or do significant damage. Or if they use their damage control party early, giving you the opportunity to set them on fire and burn them over time until their damage control party is available again and you're still gonna have the same chance to destroy modules on the deck of a battleship when you're in a battleship versus battleship engagement using HE except for you're gonna have more of a chance to damage the turrets 
the anti-aircraft guns, and the secondaries. The steering and the engine modules still are a bit harder to break on battleships, but they can be broke. Now, let's look at battleships versus destroyers and cruisers. If you're in a battleship and you're facing a destroyer, it is always best to use HE shells to kill them. Almost always, your high caliber battleship shells will have no problem inflicting massive damage upon destroyers if they are aimed correctly. It requires a little bit more lead and skill, but if you're aiming in the same areas on the ship, you will do tons of damage. And for battleship versus cruiser, 90% of the time, you're going to be using your AP shells to do the big damage. But you will need to use HE if the cruiser decides to bow tank or even kite away as it allows you to get fires and mod damage. But anyways guys, this was your guide to HE shells for all classes versus all classes in World of Warships Legends. I hope this information was helpful and if it was, please do consider subscribing for more Legends content and make sure to check out my AP shell guide in the next video. But until the next video guys, we will see y'all later.